I'm Crazy Marty, and today we're going to review a dog pooping and a Titan tree and post puller. It's getting windy, uh, storm rolling in, but uh, anyways, this is how it comes shipped uh, in a metal cage that's missing some bolts, uh, so when you lift it up, it may fall apart. Uh, now we got to get it out of this thing and get out of the rain here, so we'll get to it here in a bit. All right, now that it's done with the rainstorm and everything is a complete soggy mess out here, we can at least continue with the review of the Titan uh, tree and fence post puller thing. Let's uh, take a look at how it comes out of the box. All right, so here it is uh, as it comes after you unwrap it. There is a manual and some decals and stickers that come with it if you like to advertise. One thing I do notice is that uh, there's quite a bit of play in the pins. You know, they're just kind of they're just kind of there. Quite a bit of movement in the in the rams and in the ram pins and whatnot. Uh, they did add in a grease fitting there, so if you wanted to put grease in it, I guess you know it looks like they squirted something in there. Uh, you can. But everything's so sloppy anyways, it's not like it needs grease. So let's get it out the rest of the way and see what it does. All right, so we've got our tree and our bush puller set up. Well, they uh, didn't tighten up the fittings properly. Something's not right there because that don't look right. Shouldn't be leaking like that. So we got to check for leaks. A little bit more. I don't know if it's leaking underneath their uh, guarded, shielded area here. We'll have to find out. So here's a better view of how loose the pins and stuff are on these things. I mean, she flops around a little bit, but I guess that's all right. Let's now that we got the stuff tightened up, let's see if it leaks. So now we got the jaws opened up fully, so uh, we're, you know, pretty good size on the opening there, about 12 inches, I would guess. Uh, I mean, it is a pretty basic setup on how this stuff works. They could have went with a longer ram. they had a longer ram and then move the move the ram out here so you would get more more energy into the jaws but uh they did it the way they did it so it is what it is now let's see if it'll actually grip something and pull it out So, in conclusion, final thoughts on the Titan tree and post puller. Uh, is it a silver bullet for your project? Probably not. No such thing as a silver bullet. Unless, of course, you are the Lone Ranger. But it does tear the shit out of things. Does it rip bruises out by the roots? Well, sometimes it does. Sometimes it doesn't. It depends on the bush. You know, your mileage is going to vary on this type of stuff because it depends on the ground, the equipment, and the type of bush you're pulling on. I mean, if you pull on a tree, you could break it off. Or you could pull out the roots. I've had some where the big, long tap root comes out. That's the same length as the tree or the bush, whatever. Other stuff, it just snaps off right there at the at the base. And it is what it is. Uh, is it replace a 
grappling bucket? Absolutely not. Uh, is this something to have in your arsenal? Probably, depending on what you're doing. I mean, I'm I'm tearing the shit out of this stuff over here. I got to tear up all this bush that's over here. All these bushes have to come out. Uh, this is the pile that I made today with it. So it's it is it is tearing stuff up. It is tearing stuff out by the roots. But like I said, it also depends on the ground conditions. We had lots and lots of rain. So of course everything's super muddy and it seems to pull out fairly easily, except when it doesn't, and then it just snaps off and it leaves whatever root there. Uh, it just depends on the bush. Mileage may vary. So in conclusion, there's your, or the, in conclusion, that would be the end of it. So I, I don't know what else to say about this thing, it, it, except it is a useful tool. Uh, and it might work good in your inventory of uh, of, uh, uh, of attachments. In the meantime, I'm Crazy Marty with a uh, Titan Attachment Review. Bye-bye.